my poem teacher. Buddha taught me to keep it simple and direct. Muhammad asked me to preach away from birthplace. Jesus cautioned me from disciples and friends. Gandhi guided me to stay on the course of non-violence. Vivekananda allows me to speak for the world audience. All enlightened me with the universal laws of coexistence. Krishna taught me to work towards goal without expectation. Chaitanya urged me document realization beyond devotion. Tegar gave me the courage to write neglecting criticism. Netaji Shubhash exposed colonization as the united European mission. Aurobindo visualized poetry as a means for egalitarian revolution. Leaders' mistakes helped me control hormonal temptations. Media ensure time and again news can be speculations that pro-military, pro-Israeli are immune to physical and or character assassinations. Ocean pounded me with the message of persistence. Wind whispered, relaying art of free-flowing deliverance. Mandela taught me campaign for freedom is based from prison cell. Dr. King inspired that serving is not monopoly of chosen brain. Western leaders' actions unmask that Zionism is not Semitism. History taught me violence against Palestinian is anti-Semitism. Democracies around proved most not really ruling by the majority. Paperless voting fraud can elect minority, empowering military. Holocaust survivors can be vocal against peace, for war and hostility. New conspirators can infect fast political conservatives. High-tech media can really indulge people into gossips. Mother taught me caring is a property of every sentient being. Father gave me the art of praying through singing. Neighbor taught me, dig enough to pay bills, ensuring safe exit. Traveling revived my worldwide warm fellow feelings. Birds amazed me how to live minimally with sharing. Sun empowered me to illuminate all without racism. Moon echoed how to shower blessings even when sleeping. Pause by Kalki. We all come to this world as listener, become reader, viewer, spectator, speaker, as you grow up. But the wise always keeps on listening to be a knower. 